This is calculator question number six from the May 2019 SAT. College Board gives us a scatter plot showing the widths of rhododendron leaves against the temperature at which those widths were measured. They give us a very long paragraph describing this measurement, and then they tell us that at the time the temperature was 14 degrees, the width of one of the leaves was measured. By how much does the measurement differ from the predicted value? At 14 degrees, our predicted value is the line of best fit they describe that I've shown in pink, if you can see that. At 14 degrees, our predicted is 10, and our measured is the point shown at a horizontal axis value of 14 at a temperature T, 14, which is about 12. And the difference by how much does the measurement differ from predicted, 12 minus 10 is positive 2. And the measurement is greater than predicted because the measurement we see is above the line of best fit. So the difference is 2, not 10, so A and D are wrong. And they're asking about the measurement, so it refers to the measurement. The measurement is approximately 2 millimeters of width greater than the predicted value for the line of best fit. Since the measurement is above the line of best fit, that would be choice B, greater than, not choice C, where the measurement would be less than or below the line of best fit. College Board often asks you to interpret the actual observations compared to the line of best fit. This difference can be called the residual when you take Statistics 101 or AP Statistics, but you can figure out what they're asking for based just on the words in the problem. Make sure you practice these statistics questions. College Board is testing them very heavily on the SAT these days. And come back soon for my next video with math there's always more.